this is Jeannie welcome back if you're new to my channel welcome in this video I am going to share with you the final heart shaped box that I created I did decorate the box and I did decorate it in that farm theme that I mentioned in my first video in my first video I did share the process on how I made this box so be sure to check that out I used the cut apart sheet to decorate the top of the box. When you open the box, that is what the inside looks like. You can always put candy or some other fun stuff in the center there. I used my digital downloads from the Digital Collage Club to decorate just the front of the first flaps, the first pockets in the box. And again, I went with that farm theme. In each pocket are cards, um, some fun stuff that I decorated. I used the advice from cards to fill the first pocket. I added some ribbon to create a tab on the top. I just stapled it on. And then I had these beautiful little... Um, it's not fabric I don't know it's not crochet but really nice little flowers that were sent to me by Kimberly Kalia in this amazing little box that she gifted me filled with all kinds of fun items I have since added more items to the box but I love having this on my desk because I reach for it whenever I want a little something special to add to a project and in that box I found these flowers so I added uh, these flowers to each of the advice from cards. So you have advice from wildflowers, advice from coffee beans, advice from a frog, and advice from a firefly. I thought those all made sense um, in light of the farm theme. For the second um, pocket, I included some mini file folders that I inked and again I added a tab using some ribbon and used more of these flowers that were in that little box. This time um, daisies. I thought that made sense. I also used those same cute farm animal uh, digital downloads to create uh, a little file folder and you can write a little note in here add a list photos uh, anything you want really a place to journal if you want to use this box for journaling whatever the case may be so that's the second row of the pockets and then in the last row I just have these fun little tags that were also a digital download from the digital collage club I just thought they were fun and again it's a nice little journaling spot in the back I added some more ribbon at the top stapled I like stapling things I use my Tim Holtz tiny attacher to do that and so each of the back pockets has one of those cards and then I just put some um, crinkle paper in the center to um, just make it look cute and finished and yeah I can fill it with chocolate or whatever else I want and that is my box now if you like this box here's an opportunity for you to win it because I'm going to give it away I'm going to do a quick little giveaway where you can win this box I will ship it to you and I will also include other items from my stash. What those items will be, total surprise. It's up to me. <laughs> but if you would like the opportunity to win this box and some other items from my stash, all you need to be is 18 years or older, live in the United States. I'm sorry, my international friends, but shipping is expensive. And I'm going to have to put this in a rather 
a large or bigger box to make sure it doesn't get crushed. And um, you have to be subscribed to my channel. You have to be a visible subscriber. Leave a comment down below letting me know um, that you would be interested in winning this box. Also, let me know in that same comment what kind of crafting you're into. Might help me in determining what I will put in your box um, when I send it to you. Uh, I would like to send things that you can use. Um, so the best way I can figure to do that is just leave a comment down below. Let me know what kind of crafting you're into. Um, what's your style? Shabby chic, vintage, grunge, you know, stuff like that. Do you have a die cutting machine to uh, cut dies? Let me know. Or helpful. Anything you think would be helpful for me in filling a box to send to you, definitely include it down below. I will pick a winner at random using a random comment picker and once I confirm that the person selected is actually subscribed to my channel I will um, post the winner and then that person will have a certain amount of time to contact me and claim their prize if that person doesn't then I will simply go through the entire process all over again selecting people from that same video and I will do that until somebody claims the prize again 18 years or older vis visible subscriber to my channel leave a comment down below letting me know you want to be entered into the giveaway for this box and include um, what kinds of things you like and what kind of crafting you're into and what's your style? Anything you think would be helpful to um, guide me in what I put in the box I sent to you. So that is my share, my friends. Thank you so, so much for watching. I truly do appreciate you and I will catch you all in my next video. Until next time, my friends. Bye-bye.